So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to group data and create subgroups. Here we have a basic stock sheet, which includes our list of fruits, vegetables, and dairy and meat. We can already see that we have to scroll down to see the data below, and the sheer amount of information can seem quite overwhelming. This is where grouping data helps. To do so, we left click and hold in our first cell and drag it to cover all the cells that we wish to group. We then go to the data tab at the top, click the group button on the right, and then we want to click the OK to grouping just the rows. You'll see that a toggle button appears on the left hand side, as well as a dot next to each of the rows that we have just grouped. Simply clicking this toggle button will expand and collapse the subgroup we've just created. We then want to repeat this for the other groups, left click and hold in the cell, drag the mouse to cover all the cells we wish to group, then click on the group button once more, and OK to just rows. And then we repeat it one final time, left click, hold, drag to cover all the cells we wish to group, click the group button, and click OK to rows. So now we are just left with the totals for each group in a much clearer format. You can click the 1 and 2 buttons on the left to expand and collapse all subgroups at once. 2 to expand all, and 1 to collapse all. We can also apply this function to columns. For example, if we wanted to create a subgroup for all of the monthly sales information, to do so we would click again, highlight the sales we wish to group, then go to the group button, click it once more, and then click this time columns, And there you go. I hope you find that useful. Please do like, comment and subscribe and feel free to drop me an email with any requests.